Um, so uh, junior faculty is hard. I've been here officially one year and um, to buffer the winds of difficulty we formed a, a group uh, Tyler Williamson, Paul Ronksley and Kerry McBrien who is our fearless leader and um, Leda asked us to, we've been working so closely together so we decided we'd do this together and uh, Leda asked us to uh, talk about our experiences, our challenges in the last year and so um, we immediately as junior faculty and new professors thought that the best way to approach this would be a 45 minute PowerPoint presentation <laughs> with, with a very logical and in-depth background section, um, very robust methodology and uh, there will be many figures and uh, for Paul's sake very complex mathematical models um, and then we got halfway through this and we realized there's only one real way to do this and that's with a song. <laughs> oh, oh, hey, hey, look, everyone! It's it's Paul Ronsley and Tyler Tyler Williamson. Are we gonna do it back here? Let's oh, yeah, we'll do it here. Hey guys, hey. Uh, what are you guys doing here? Um, we're here to sing a song with you, man. Oh. What a fantastic idea. Uh, okay. Okay. Uh, well, well, Maybe we should, uh, what do you think? Let's, uh, let's start with some introductions, I think. Okay. Right, where to start? All right, all right. Okay. Okay. <laughs> 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 Heaven Island Journalist studies health disparities. He also runs a clinic in the Northeast for New Refugees. Tyler's a statistician, a numbers guy, if you please. When he's not running models, he's using EMRs to study chronic disease. <laughs> 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 researcher, studies high system users. Many of them are very sick, but there's also resource abusers. <laughs> was the study of multimorbidity. <laughs> <laughs> Ready? <laughs> multimorbidity puts the health system in jeopardy. If we don't tackle complexity, then the consequences will be bad, you see. Coding these patients with ICD is an inferior ontology. EMR is the space to be. It's a futuristic technology. Wow, you know, I thought that went really well, actually. <laughs> I, was, I, was, I was wondering, should we talk a little bit about the challenges? <laughs> <laughs> uh, we're not done. Whoa. We're not done yet. Yeah, that, that'd be a good thing. Let's talk a little bit about the challenge. Yeah, junior faculty's tough. Yeah. Okay, I'll do that. <laughs> We've all enjoyed our first year and the challenges that it brings. Well, the opportunities are endless. Should we say yes to everything? <laughs> yes. We all want to be together. We don't want to come across as cold. <laughs> Listen, we'd like to help and all, but we're sick of being voluntold. <laughs> stop, stop, please. <laughs> all we do is write grants, because collectively we're broke. Really, all we want to do is publish. But the IHR thinks we're a joke. <laughs> Getting data is very hard, and linkages can be wild. Don't even get me on position claims, because they'll I'll take you. your firstborn child. <laughs> Multi morbidity puts the health system in jeopardy. If we don't tackle complexity, the consequences are bad, you see. Coding these patients with ICD is an inferior ontology. EMR is a space to be. It's a futuristic technology. Hey, hey, I'm, I, this is going better than I thought it was going to go. <laughs> yes. We should spend a little bit of time talking about those that have uh, made a big impact in our life this year, though. I think that's, we got to thank our mentors. I yeah. think that's really appropriate. Yeah. Bill's so freaking busy that we hardly ever see him. 
But he's so tall and handsome that we all just want to be him. <laughs> And he's a big part of score, but he's won so many awards we don't even know what they're for. <laughs> Brent is our new fearless leader, and she's not very tall, but she's publishing Nijam and Jamma, and she's also smarter than Paul. <laughs> Tight-knit lips. 